Hello. Today I'm going to be doing a review of Serum LT Hooded Jacket by Arcteryx. Um, I'm going to be showing you the features, how it fits on me, what I like about it, and then what I wish it had or what I don't like. And so just to start this review off, I'm going to show you um, what it fits like. Um, this is a medium jacket, and to give you an idea of my dimensions, I'm 5'8 and, and weigh slightly under um, 160 pounds. So as you can see, it's a little bit more of an athletic fit jacket. Um, it does fit a little bit tighter. And um, when I zip it up, you guys will see that um, it's very snug, uh, not too much space underneath for layering, um, but that's good that it fits well if that's kind of the sort of look you're going for. And so just to give you an idea of what it looks like around, I'll give you the 360. And so this jacket's actually really warm. It has 850 fill down, so it's really high quality down. Um, just to give you an idea, I was using it about a week ago over Thanksgiving. Um, we went, you know, walking in the woods. It was slightly below freezing, and I was fine with just this jacket on with a, a long sleeve shirt underneath this, and I was plenty warm. I actually had to take the hood off. And um, speaking of the hood, um, that's another feature I really like of this jacket that it, the hood really keeps the warmth um, a lot more, um, just because everything gets kept in here. And we zip it up all the way. You have a nice zipper garage that makes it feel very comfortable um, when you're walking and when you're breathing and sweat starts coming through. And the other thing I wanted to show you guys is that this jacket has a very unique um, form in the fact that like down is all throughout here and throughout all the back and the sides. But as you can see here in the cuffs, this is actually not filled with down but has a synthetic type of feel uh, fill on it. And also on the armpits and right around this area right here. And so the reason they do that is down when it gets wet isn't as insulative, but the synthetic material, if it does get wet, it can still keep you warm. And so these are the places that um, Arcteryx claims are going to be the places that are most prone to getting wet. And so I've had an actual, actual chance to use that in real world situations. So when I went out, usually and it gets cold outside, I put this up here and I'm breathing through it. And this ends up getting soaked just because of, you know, sweat, moisture. And because it gets soaked, I don't have to worry about it, you know, not being able to be insulated as much or, you know, it still works and I don't feel bad about it as much. And so just to go over some of the specs of this jacket, it does um, weigh about 9.7 ounces. So it's, it's actually a really lightweight jacket. Um, it does have a 10 by 20 uh, denier fabric. So it's, it's quite a, a light fabric on the lighter side. As you can see, there's some spots here. I don't know if you can see on the video, but there's a little black feather there. So it is a little bit see-through. And so that's, that is something you want to consider. Um, it does have a DWR finish, so it will repel water on a light day of rain and will also um, beat up, which is really nice. But um, overall, I've really enjoyed this jacket. It just feels very lightweight. Um, it feels great. Um, I feel like I have really good range of motion, good movement with it. Um, I haven't ever had any big problems with it, and I just kind of throw it on um, whenever it's a little bit chilly outside. So I feel like it does a great job at keeping you warm, even below freezing temperatures. Um, and the one downside that I would say that I wish it would have is, um, as you can see in the back here, there is no draw cord, but it does have an elastic. And so that does keep really tight. I haven't ever really had an issue with that, but I know a lot of people really like, you know, when wind picks up or there's severe conditions, um, people would like to see that. Um, I haven't had a problem with it, but it would be nice. Um, other thing is, it would be nice if it had an extra pocket, um, just kind of keep a phone or something, like maybe a chest pocket. It doesn't have a pocket. Um, they, I think they really tried to keep the weight low on this one to kind of be more geared towards performance. Um, and it does come with a stuff sack that um, is removable. It just stays in the pocket just so it doesn't get lost. And um, it, it can be stuffed. And I can show you what that looks like once it's stuffed. But it uses the same fabric um, that the actual coat is made out of. But overall, like I'd like to say is that I've really enjoyed this jacket. I feel like it's very high quality. I feel like it's going to last several years, and it's going to keep me warm in these um, cold Wisconsin winters. Um, so thank you for watching my video. If you have any questions, please leave comments down below. I'll get back to you if I can. Thank you.